his vision of what instruments should do is still 10 years past our ability to make them. Look at the things he invented and the things he modified. You're talking about a historic character here. He doesn't know it, but he is, <laughs> you know? Let alone putting a screwdriver and a soldering iron together to come up with the sound. And it was up to us to make the sounds that would come to market. There's all kinds of stories through history when you have the greats, the Galileos were persecuted. And you have to really think that Don Lewis is like a Galileo. Don was a threat. He was an extraordinary danger to the Musicians' Union. I mean, the Musicians' Union at that point was hanging on for dear life. To me, it was never uh, an attempt to displace a musician. It was just another instrument and in color in the orchestration. There were a lot of things that they insisted continued as a tradition. One of which was black musicians were listed separately than white musicians. I mean, it takes a while to, to overcome that kind of pre-programmed prejudice. He was a pioneer. His forward thinking was way beyond what most people were even dreaming of. He got it. How dynamic these sounds were and just how difficult it was to do that. Already we think uh, how to synchronize each other, always program, but he, he did it by himself. Thank you. Thank you.